absolutely cannot believe I forgot to mention that feature about the Jackery Lithium. Well, yesterday I did a five minute video about test results with the Jackery powering this 20 liter Iceco Go 20. I'm getting a big response. I think I already have a 1100 views in a very short amount of time. But there's something very important I forgot to tell you that I usually do mention whenever I talk about these Jackery units, and I'll need to do that right now, and I'll make it pretty short. Thanks for watching. Well, I'm going to allow myself two minutes, and here we go. The Jackery lithium batteries are great, and what I, one feature that's very important for you to know and understand, you need to know this what, whether you buy a Jackery or not, is these 12-volt ports. Uh, with the 500, you plug in here, just like you see in a car, and with the Jackery 160, you have this adapter that you plug in, and then you plug in the refrigerator or whatever else you're running. Well, what's important to know is that these 12 volt outputs are regulated. It is so important that you understand that. 12 volt regulated means that as the power goes down on any of these jacker units from 100 to 90 to 80 on down, that it will constantly be sending out 13.3 volts, no matter what the state of charge is. And that will allow this refrigerator to keep running. Um, I have a friend who has a different brand of lithium battery, and when that came down to about 50%, his 12-volt uh, Alpacool refrigerator turned off, just like that. And refrigerators, 12-volt refrigerators are very sensitive to the power that comes to them, and they're 12-volt, some of them will let it get down to 11, but when it gets much below 11 volts down, they will shut off. And wouldn't that be just be great? You, you're gone all day, and you thought that you're uh, refrigerator or freezer was running and it really wasn't. So all the Jackery's have a 12 volt regulated port and that means that it's going to send out this steady amount of power all the way down to zero and that's what it did in those tests that I did. Uh, there are some brands that have the 12 volt. I'm not going to mention the ones that do or don't because those things may change. I do know that there's one major brand that doesn't have it and you have to pay extra buy an adapter to make it work. But there are also some major brands that don't have it, and hopefully they will add that eventually. But really make sure when you get a lithium battery and you're going to run a 12-volt refrigerator especially, make sure that it's a 12-volt regulated port, okay? Otherwise, you'll be an unhappy camper for sure. Thanks for watching. I made it.